This is a Samuel Taylor Coleridge poems, and I'm going to read some portions from the Crewe manuscript of Kubla Khan in Xanadu did Kubla Khan, a stately pleasure dome decree, where Aleph, the sacred river ran through caverns measureless to man, down to a sunless sea, so twice six miles of fertile ground, with walls and towers were compassed round, and here were gardens right with sinuous rills, were blossomed many an incense bearing tree, and here were forests ancient as the hills, enfolding sunny spots of greenery. But oh, that deep romantic chasm that slanted down a green hill upward a southern cover, a savage place as holy and enchanted as air beneath a waning moon was haunted by a woman wailing for her demon lover from forth this chasm with hideous turmoil seething, as if this earth in fast thick pants were breathing, a mighty fountain momently was forced, amid whose swift half intermittent burst, huge fragments vaulted like rebounding hail, or shabby grain beneath the thresher's flail, and mid these dancing rocks at once and ever, it flung up momently the sacred river. Five miles meandering with amazed emotion, through wood and dale the sacred river ran, then reached the caverns measureless to man, and sank in tumult to a lifeless ocean. Amid this tumult, Kubla heard from far ancestral voices prophesizing war. The shadow of the dome of pleasure floated midway on the wave, where was heard the mingled measure. In Xanadu did Kubla come, a stately pleasure dome decree, where Alf the sacred river ran through caverns measureless to man, down to a sunless sea, so twice five miles of fertile ground, with walls and towers were gilded round, and here were gardens bright with sinuous thrills where blossomed many an incense-bearing tree, and here were forests ancient as the hills, enfolding sunny spots of greenery. An excerpt from Kubla Khan, 1816 version, from this great poet. And maybe you remember one great rock band, progressive band called Rush,